Now, the House of Representatives Committee on Solid Minerals have described the 29 billion naira allocated to the sector for the next fiscal year as grossly inadequate. And this was when Minister of Solid Minerals Deli Alake appeared before the Committee for Budget Defense. National Assembly correspondent Mitari Ekmen reports. The solid minerals sector is considered crucial to Nigeria's quest for economic diversification and industrialization. But lawmakers regard the 29 billion naira proposed for the sector in 2024 as paltry and inadequate to drive growth in the sector. Let me use this medium to call on the President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria to rethink and reconsider the paltry sums that were allocated to this sector. We must be careful not to kill the goose that lays the golden eggs. We are in a phase of energy transition and solid minerals is the next frontier. Reeling out the potentials of the ministry's seven-point agenda for the solid minerals sector, the minister affirms that 250 billion naira is needed for exploration of minerals. We need to have a formal structure that the multinationals can deal with. Now these illegal miners are not your artisanal miners. These are heavy, powerful individuals in our country. And they are Nigerians. At an interface with the House Committee on Population, the National Population Commission is seeking more funding for the conduct of the next national census. We have to update the enumeration area maps. By the time we finish uh, the enumeration area mapping, the building stock that we reported as uh, 65 million may increase to something a lot higher because Nigeria is a country where construction is going on daily, on a daily basis. The commission says the president has the prerogative to announce the date for the next national census from the National Assembly, Mitaire Ikben.